It's time for the One Bar and Lepica Show, bringing you anything and everything Minnesota Vikings. Welcome to professional football. All right, welcome back to the One Bar and Lepica Show. I am One Bar, and today it is Friday. That means it is Vikings trivia. I'm a little late to the game. Usually I'm in the morning, but damn it, I'm getting to it, and it's still Friday. This episode, we are talking kickers, kickers. Vikings kickers is a little bit of a sore spot. There's going to be some tough names that are going to be na- mentioned in this this week's trivia, but damn it, we'll get through it together. Before we get into that, remember, subscribe to the One Mile Up Good Show, like the videos. Let's get into it. Remember, keep your answers in your melon till the end, uh, and I'll ramble off the answer. So five questions, five questions. I'm not going to lie. This isn't the easiest, uh, easiest one. I'm going to say if you get more than two, you did pretty good. So uh, we'll see. So. Number one, kicker edition for the Vikings, the 1998 championship game. Yes, still a little bit too soon to talk about, but I got to bring it up. The opposing team, the Atlanta Falcons, their kicker, game-winning field goal, later went to play for the Vikings. Who was it? Which kicker who won that championship game ended up playing for the Vikings later in his career? Throwing you a softball here. Everybody should get this one. Number two, most career field goals for the Vikings career. Straight up, who's got the most career field goals? And number three, highest career field goal percentage for a Vikings kicker. Highest career field goal percentage for the Vikings. Number four, most career 50 plus yarders. Who's got that big old hog of a leg? Most career, and this one isn't even close. And final, final, got to go, got to go a little ways back. Who was the kicker that didn't wear a shoe or a sock? It was short-lived, but he played for us, and I remember him. But what was his name? He did not wear a shoe or a sock, barefoot kicker. All right, that is it. Let's get into it. Uh, 1998 championship game. The guy who won the game ended up coming back for the Vikings in 2004. Morton Anderson, Morton Anderson. Man, that guy played for like 97 years. All right. Next one. Most career field goals by a Viking. This one really wasn't even close either. Fred Cox, Fred Cox, RIP baby. He had 282 field goals made. The next was actually Ryan Longwell, 135. All right, number three, which Viking kicker has the highest career field goal percentage? This, this is going to surprise people, but it is King Kai Forbath. Kai Forbath did not get the love he probably deserved. In, he, he only played for, what, a year and a half, but 88.7 field goal percentage. So well done, King Kai. Unfortunately, he had some issues with those extra points. Uh, next one, most career 50-yard field goal, 50-plus yard field goals. And like I said, this one isn't even close. Blair Walsh wipes the floor with everybody else. He had 24. He was career 24 of 34 from 50 yards, and that is almost unheard of. Next one was Ryan Longwell with 11. So Blair Walsh. And final, final, who was our barefooted kicker? 1989, Rich Carlos. Yes, Rich Carlos, former Bronco, came to the Vikings for a year. Uh, I remember on special teams one year, he went down and got the tackle, and I saw his little bare foot hanging out there. It was fantastic. <laughs> All right. Let me know how you did. Hit me up in the comments. Four for four or four for five, one for five. Let me know. And uh, tune, tune in next week, uh, next Friday, for more trivia.